Hello you Demi I am Shahzad Ahmed from shekzi.com and uh, welcome to lecture number 5 Today is we are going to discuss about the load how can you use the load and uh, what is the difference between uh, ready and load so we have uh, discussed about the ready in our previous lectures for now i am saying that i have a iframe that i have a iframe so let me show you something so you can easily understand how can you use the load or what is the difference between ready and the load for suppose i am saying i have a iframe and uh, the src is uh, https https and i am saying www.usain.edu.pk so this is the official website of uh, a university now i am saying that when the dom is ready just show me the alert working go to your page refresh the page as you can see okay just let me confirm since university okay this is the official website okay so now uh, wait for a few second okay this is the official website now just refresh the page so now as you can see you have alert showing then after the alert the iframe is loading so that's why because you are because the dom is ready so that's why it's showing for suppose if you are saying that when your this element is fully loaded then show me something or then perform the specific task so how can you do that for suppose i am saying hit the iframe uh, okay let me show you something for suppose i am saying when the dom is ready and then i'm saying that i'm creating the selector this selector on don't worry it takes two parameters we will discuss about the on for uh, in related lectures but for now i'm saying load okay now i'm saying when the this iframe is load after that i'm saying just show me the working or just show me the alert go to your page you refresh the page so now as you can see you are after the loading of your iframe then you are showing the alert so as you can see as you can see after the showing of your iframe then you are loading the alert or you can also use this when your iframe is loaded then alert something okay so we will discuss about the anonymous functions in related lectures but for now i am just going to show you or just i am showing you that uh, in this way you can use the load functionality of the jquery so before using the jquery functionality you have to add the jquery file then you can call any jquery function or you can call any anonymous functions so i think this is enough for today in the next lecture we are going to cover some other function like uh, unload and some other functions so thank you for watching